detected an anomaly. You fucking better detect it. It's what I asked that no. I have found something. He's mine. I don't share. Probe away. Actually, um, it's gonna date the video, but who fucking cares? I never Watch upload these anyway properly. Um, I was gonna do Grand Theft Auto when it hit midnight, but I realized it doesn't unlock until like 10 a.m. I was like, oh, okay, because some games unlock at midnight, but not that. At least from what I saw. I was like, oh, that'd be cool to play for a little bit, but I think it's 10 a.m. My time, at least. So we'll end up doing it Sunday, because... John will be around for the weekend, and God knows what we'll play. John, don't discuss what we're going to do for the stream until, like, an hour before it. We're like, alright, what do we want to do? And then we decide, let's try something that's obnoxiously pain in the ass to set up, and then it just changes back into, how about something else? Launching probe. Probe launched. All I know is he'll probably want to continue Spore, and then after that, I don't know if there's anything else. Launching Suck it dry. Depleted. Or Jacob and his pull incendiary. I mean, that's like the only thing that he gets barrier. Other than that, he's not, not super useful. You know what? Of course, they did. There's a simulator for everything. You know what, Jacob? You know we'll bring uh, we'll bring Miranda for once. Did you two know each other? She knows how to slam. And you know what? You can give us the squad inferno ammo. You can be like Grunt. We'll just, uh, you, you're all about weapon damage and you got a little bit of pull. God, my fucking warp does check shit. I should have been up in that too. I keep getting suggestions for a lot of simulators. So many random ones that I get suggest because I played, you know, cooking sim and gas station sim. And also playing like my summer car, which is like most ridiculous style of like a simulator game that I could play because I will just I never succeed in that game. There it is, and mostly intact. They could have survived impact, but it's been years. Looks like it was stripped after the crash. They'd have tried to get a beacon up as soon as possible. Along with us anymore, we've done horrible things to the crew. The conditions they're in, they don't understand what we're doing to them. Distract them for two seconds and they forget what, what, what you did before the bruises show. Repeat, toxology alert. Danger of rapid neural decay. From the look of it, this beacon's been here a while. Why would they wait years to signal? Pause in beacon protocol. Eight years, 237 days, seven hours. Pause is recorded as record deleted by acting captain Ronald Taylor. That's not right. My father was first officer. Ronald Taylor was promoted under emergency command protocols. Other flagged issues, unsafe deceleration, Local food and neural decay. Beacon activation protocols. 
I assume unsafe deceleration refers to the crash. Give me the details. Following an unspecified impact and sublight drive failure, the Hugo Gernsback made an unscheduled descent at 465% of theoretical recommended suborbital velocity. Seems about right. Hugo Gernsback then decelerated at 782% of theoretical recommended approach velocity, sustaining significant damage to investment and crew. Who's in command of this ship? Where are the survivors? Captain Harris Fairchild reported killed following unscheduled suborbital descent. First Officer Ronald Taylor promoted infield to acting captain. But where is he now? The location of the remaining crew of the Hugo Gernsback is unknown. This beacon has been unattended for several maintenance cycles. Why wasn't the beacon activated before now? This emergency beacon became functional after 358 days, 12 hours. Following the unscheduled suborbital descent of the Hugo Gernsback, activation was triggered remotely after eight years, 237 days, seven hours, on the authority of Acting Captain Ronald Taylor. Pause in beacon protocol is recorded as record deleted. Local food impairs brain functions? What are the effects? Impairment of mental function due to chemical imbalance begins within seven days of ingesting local flora regardless of decontamination or preparation. Impact on higher cognitive <laughs> abilities and long-term memory is cumulative, but significant within a standard month. It is not known if neural decay is permanent. Data collection was not completed. Come on, let's get let's going. Let's check the ship. My father had the beacon for almost nine years. Maybe that neural decay affected him. Avoiding it for a decade seems unlikely. That's so bulky. Oh god. It's sure easier now. What's the harm? We're stuck here. Jesus Christ. Everyone's trying to get their dick wet. Just burning unnecessary calories. <laughs> Your credits. After a crash, you can't expect the luxury of due, due, due process, but this isn't a military ship. Just bumping the command line up a notch doesn't work. Ca Ca Captain Fairchild knew this crew, crew, crew. His replacement doesn't command the same level of respect. I'm hoping the man has it in him, but I don't know. Well, they seem to doubt your father. I can't remember anything. They have to hurry. You you have fun there. Distress Beacon, VI, whatever the hell it is. You came from the sky? The leader said someone would come. He delayed for so long, but he still has power. Some have lost faith. The hunters, they will have seen your star. They will not let you help him. Who are you? What was your rank on the Gernsback? Uh, I, I, I can't think. The leader thinks for us they all come we serve so so we can go messed up but some want to fight him they were cast out he exiled them so they hunt his machines and those who help him they don't believe that rescue fuck it won. hunters they won't stop until the leader is dead it's the one thing you're getting kill them agents of the liar he will not escape 
They've seen us. Now let's finish you off. Don't say that, Miranda. Out of context, that sounds weird. Doing it, Jacob. You're really killing it. This will put them down. That wasn't neural decay. They were feral. You killed them, but there are more every day. They want to fight, but I just want to go home. She's lost it. We need to find someone who can make sense of this. Yeah. Completely lost it. Only my little bit. I'm pretty much full on renegades. So it doesn't even fucking matter if I do good or not anymore. I'm still gonna be an asshole. Cause that was the one nice deed for today. Strip for parts. Tech's wearing out. Those hunters must be laying on the pressure. Is that a set? They better be friendlier than the beach group. I need answers. I don't think they're gonna be friendly with me though. I'm an asshole. They're clearly docile, but in the same uniform remnants as those who attacked us. Is this an earlier stage, or did the exile make the others violent? Why is everyone here female? Can't be a coincidence. It doesn't matter right now. One of these people must know what my father has to do with this. You have his face. He promised to call the sky, but he sends nothing. He forced us to eat, to decay. You are cursed with his face. And you certainly seem to have a way with words. You heard her. <laughs> I have his face. My father forced the crew to eat toxic food. What the hell? He has a cruel face. His cruel face. You have a way with words there. He keeps us. He is bad. He has a bad face like the other. Like him. You'll hurt me. On our right! Jesus Christ, I was looking. Fuck off. One left. I'm taking fire. Everyone using these shitty mechs. Weapons are forbidden. Patrols like that are a little much against this bunch. Well, that would make them hate him. Maybe it was just for defense. Just playing a survival game. Please. He, you have his face. But you fight his machines. He yeah. might stop this. This looks crazy. I how to read. But this was the start. What he promised and what they did to us. We need the sky. God, you're Take so crazy. The sky. Think on your own time. What's in there? It's a crew logbook. Some of them thought the beacon repair was taking too long. They were afraid they'd run out of supplies and lose their minds to the decay. My father restricted the ship food for himself and the other officers so they wouldn't be affected. Everybody else had to eat the toxic food and hope for treatment later. The rest is a casualty list. A few mutinied over the decision. My father and his officers turned the mechs on them. Not what I would have done, but they were in a desperate situation. How long do you stay desperate? The numbers go up from there. More incidents, harsh punishments. It's like they're cattle or toys. In a year, all the male crew members are flagged as exiled or dead. They separated out the women, assigned them to officers like pets. And after the beacon is fixed, the officers appear in the casualties too. After. My father took control and didn't stop it. Anything in there about whether the effects of the toxic food can be treated? Nothing. But it seems like the right call. If everyone gets it, who's left to fix the beacon? You'd never get out. But they did fix it. And the signal wasn't sent until now. I'm starting to see why. Does it say why he separated the men and the women? Or is it as bad as it seems? No, it turns to gibberish. Maybe the men got violent early on, but from the state of this place, I'd say the hunter thing is recent. What he allowed here, Shepard? I don't see any justification. Hey, they, they, I'd fit in. 
can't read. I can't read. Jesus Christ. We haven't seen any other officers. There were five after the crash. Medical, engineering, bridge staff. Should have had no problem fixing the beacon and keeping people safe. All killed within the same week. About a month after the beacon was repaired. It's looking like he only activated the beacon because the men have come back ready to fight. He let this happen, and now it's biting him in the ass. Nine years. Why didn't he set it right? I need to find this man. Then we're gonna stick a remote up his ass. It's gonna blow! I say shoot him in the dick with a remote in his ass. The old corpse has been posed like a warning. We're just gonna ignore him. Left where they fell. The hunters started fighting back. Enemies dead. Sucks for him that I'm a huge asshole. Hmm, that didn't seem right. Something doesn't seem right about this. There we go. How about we do it that way? Thank you. He had plenty of choices. A little late to blame the victims. We come in peace. We bring woman. <laughs> Fall and die. <laughs> oh, the boy, not it. Fighting the play remote is dick. As long as we get to use the remote. Allied force casualty. Gravity's one meter. Brother. One less. Slam him. Use this. We could use this. Make activity. Get over here. There we go. Taking heavy fire. <laughs> I didn't come. He had his fun, and now he wants out. Here we go. I didn't come, I came. Ugh. God, Brandon's now had access to VR porn. <laughs> Someone save him. Hold on, I have this weapon now. Doesn't do exactly what I thought it would. <laughs> Using. Well, whatever, it worked. <laughs> it worked nonetheless. in the eye and hear him justify this. I'll justify something for you, all right. 
You know, look your father in the eye and be like, where is my mother? In a rousing game of Age of Empires where you use Taunt 30 over and over. Specifically, three. Got him. You're here. I knew a real squad would blow through just fine. Sorry if the mech scuffed your pants. I'll get you something nice when we get back to Alliance Space. I've got to have some back pay coming. What about your crew, acting captain? Total loss. The toxic food turned them wild. They propped me up here in some kind of ritual behavior. Waiting for a chance to signal has been hell. That's the best you can do? You let all your people talk back like that? <laughs> Who are you exactly? Commander Shepard of the Normandy. I believe you're acquainted with Mr. Taylor. Taylor? Jacob? No. Not Jacob. Why not me? Would ten years of this look better to anyone else in the galaxy? You have to understand. This isn't me. The realities of command, they change you. I wasn't ready for that. I made sure you were taught right. Before I left, I hoped to leave it at that. I'm not biting, Captain. At some point, you chose to do this to your crew. You. What was that moment? I want to know that there was an actual reason. There was resistance to the plan. Mutiny. We had to take a hard line to keep order. And things settled down. As the decay set in, we made sure the crew were comfortable. Some even seemed happier. Ignorance is bliss, right? And they were grateful for guidance. Like an instinct. Pure authority was... easy. At first. Months in, the effect lowered inhibitions. They got territorial. Rank, protocol... They got remo uh, uh, ro they remotes up their ass. <laughs> we had to establish dominance. After a while, the perks seemed normal. That's it? You created a harem and played king? Ten years in a juvenile fantasy? I can't point to where it all went wrong. But when the beacon was ready, revealing what happened didn't seem like a good idea. What happened to the other officers? Anders found his conscience a little late to step back. He had an accident. Things got tense. End of the day, I was the one with the mechs. I got a little basic in setting examples. But I was kind to my people once things settled down. Seemed like I'd earned some peace. You fought over people like they were toys. Things. The stores from the ship couldn't last forever. You had to know this would end one day. Dining for one can really stretch things out. Besides, I can think of a lot worse retirement plans than stripping down and joining the droolers. That was before the hunters, of course. Dumb or not, I'd feel it if they got their hands on me now. They want blood. I'd prefer to keep it. <laughs> it's all about you. Everything. You didn't feel any responsibility to get out of here for the sake of family? I gave him a good start. He was a smart kid and was better off not following me. We figured that out a long time before I took jobs in deep space. And after things escalated here, it seemed best to just disappear off the galactic map. Till you needed someone to save your ass. What triggered the males to change and threaten you? This planet has Penis. some strange cycles to it. I've seen some plants around I never saw before. Odd weather. Maybe some just adapted a little too well. And if you treat them like animals, big shock. They become animals. Can't say this wouldn't be a hell of a vacation. But you don't get to just walk away after all this time. You're damn right he doesn't. What happened here, I should vent his head. But he's not even worth pulling the trigger. I don't know who you are, because you're not any father I remember. I'm pretty sure we can spare the ammo. Yeah, you're right. But I'm not taking the shot. My father owned his mistakes. He was a different man. A good man. Half charged. You've seen the crazy ones. This won't stop them. It's not for them, Dad.
Well, there you go. I like when it shows Jacob's power has unlocked a barrier and it shows an Asari photo. get as much as a glimpse and you're restricted to decaf. Great, may as well serve it in the airlock, you hard ass. I heard that. What do you mean it wasn't you? Jacob, if I had leaked the information about the Gernsback, I would be smiling at your resolution of the situation. I am not smiling. Really? Because given the result, it feels like something you'd have your hands in. You know very little about me, Shepard. Don't presume to understand my intentions. Cerberus is ultimately about humanity. My people are valuable to me. Fine. You didn't forward it. So who did? I did. Was this supposed to be a favor? Or did you just want to see him squirm? What he did with it was his own business. There was a time when it mattered to you. Sending this along seemed like keeping an old promise. I keep my promises. Miranda, we'll discuss your liberal interpretation of security protocol in private. Shepard, Jacob. Come on, we've got work to do. Hi, <laughs> Commander. Get back to work, Jacob. Shepard, thanks for the help. Let's not make a habit of it. I'm insane with power. Getting all the upgrades. Sure. Good enough for me. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. There you go, Jacob. Now you're all fixed. I don't know if the Firewalker missions are even worth doing. Like, I can't remember. I think they give you some stuff, but... I don't remember if they're really that important, because they are just kind of like random little side things. It might give me credits and uh, supplies, and probably new tech. Okay, one thing. Do, 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 do. Like to look up, it seems like people say, No, it's not worth doing. Kind of like doing those types of missions, all right. 
I'm not gonna... Other than, like, some little things here and there, I'm not gonna worry about it. There is Project Overlord, though, that we could go take a look at, though. I'll investigate that. Wee! Yo, Jacob, you got a new outfit. Spring Jack and Thane, the, the glasses crew. You do great against, you know, stuff. You know what? We'll bring Thane along. We haven't gotten to use him much, so you know what, Thane? Come on down. Figured. Gonna be one of these missions, but I'm still gonna check it out nonetheless. One of these, like, kind of basic coming in, doing My something mission. The situation is urgent. We're facing a catastrophic VI breakout. I'll explain the details later. But you must retract that transmission dish. The controls aren't far from your position. I'll do my best. Here, on the monitor. Ah, there you are. I've locked myself in a computer room on the far side of the base. There are Geth on the loose. A rogue VI program has seized control and I've lost a lot of friends. Not today. Geth should have brought you know the one stop. Geth killer on our team. That isn't me. Jacob. <laughs> God. Damn it. The VI's overridden the controls. We have to stop him. He's trying to upload his program off planet. Destroy the antenna inside the dish. There's a tram on the lower level. Get to it as fast as you can. I'll do the best I can. But I'm scared. Stop. I love filet with a side of egg salad. My favorite. My shield is down. He says he'll love you a long time. Who knew?
Stop with the missiles. Watch for heavy weapons. Yeah, I've noticed. Oh, that's you guys. I was like, what the that's fuck? Your aid. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. I didn't expect you guys to be running up the fucking stairs. I'm shooting anything that runs at me. Booked it at me. I was scared. I'm saying using a sniper rifle. Feel like it's not working out great for him, but hey. You know, we'll see how that goes. was a separate message. I think you're thinking they're gonna walk right off. Well, I want them just to walk right off, like, well, much for them being super smart. I want them to do things that I would do. Hope they get on that. Hopefully service will get right up. Oh, right. That's us. You know it's Cerberus? How many fucking logos do you need? Yeah. Yeah, we know. I'll get approval at some point. I just came here because I thought these people told me they had killer meatballs. I'm getting attacked. I haven't seen a single meatball. You all right? Look like you had a bit of a hard time with that flamethrower guy burning you. Like how many? How many more are you gonna fire? I can take them all, Nick. That's not hitting anyone. Off with the missiles. Oh, 
don't know what you're doing. Someone else with a shield around here. Hit the wall. Sounds simple enough. Warning. Structural integrity of dish has been compromised. Yep, I don't want to eat another one. I'm full. Clean. I could not eat another bite. Right. Can we stop? I'm gonna throw up. Tally around more often. Hey, hey, ow, 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 ow. what the fuck? Get away. Did that take care of your problem? You've done it. You've severed the link to the satellite. You've got to be kidding. Oh, the whole thing's giving way. We got to get the fuck out of here. Oh, my legs. What's going on around here? Man's reach exceeding his grasp. Come on, I'll explain. But you almost broke Thade's glasses. Have my thanks, Commander Shepard. You bought us some time, though probably not much. This isn't over yet. You owe us that explanation. This is Project Overlord, an attempt to gain influence over the Geth by interfacing a human mind with a VI. The results have been less than satisfactory. It looks like some progress was made. Yes. Even amid chaos, there are lessons to be learned. My brother, David, volunteered to serve as a test subject, but his mind couldn't handle the VI connection. He's like a virus now. Infecting our networks and seizing control of any technology he finds. Hey, do you have any idea what you're it's looking why at? Had to nope. Destroy the dish. Imagine if his program got off world. How do we stop him? David, the VI has fortified itself in the main laboratory at Atlas Station. It's in lockdown now. To enter, you need to manually override security from our facilities in the Prometheus and Vulcan stations. What happens if I have to kill your brother? Let's just hope it doesn't come to that. Well, I'm an asshole, so it probably might come to that. I'm heading out now. The other stations are all within driving distance. Best of luck, Commander. Tell me how to get the hell out of here. God. 
Doesn't matter which one you hit first, but you can't enter Atlas Station until you've dealt with both. Also, keep an eye out for Cerberus security mechs. The VI has likely taken control of them. Archer out. Yeah, I'll, I'll do the best I can. This is the last time I do a side mission. Sorry, I'm already leaving. <laughs> well, this is what we're going to be dealing with. Possible mechs and maybe Geth, who knows. I will bring you a log. Jack, you want to fuck shit up? Saved your points, so I could have gotten warp ammo for us. I'll bring with the, I'll bring this along and see how that goes if I ever use it. I have that and have that if I want to use it. We'll try this thing. Mechs. It's always these. These shitty little mech guys. Hello! <laughs> It's me, I'm Shepard! Noticed. Believe me, I've noticed. You win. Oh, God. Sure. Uh, I don't know why I was doing that. Up we go. I'll park here, don't worry. Warning. Automated controls are offline. Core systems have been compromised. Marks. Oh, that's why we gotta hack it. Now that you hacked it, you gave it a shield and it's stronger. And you can't fight your master. Warning. Pressure levels in Engineer's log. We've registered a huge spike in energy consumption. My technicians traced it to the experiment underway at Atlas Station. We're trying to raise them now. I did what you wanted. I'm hungry. <laughs> Where is my meatloaf?
Oh, hey, Jack. I don't know why you sprint. Were you, did you get scared? Did you need me to hold you? You fucking sprinted right at me. God, everybody's just jumping to me. Like, come on, I'm already taken. Sadly tied down by Liara. It's not like Judgment Lost Judgment where I can have like 12 different girlfriends. <laughs> it did not matter. Oh, Jesus. Uh, my tech armor was left behind. That is my body. Okay, well. It's fine, we don't need it. Believe it. That doesn't last for very long. Nope, I don't want any. This thing just ruins me. Well, we're dead. I hate these missions and these vehicles. That's why it's the last fucking side mission I do. I'm not fucking doing this. I want to run around and use my goddamn biotic powers and shit. I don't fucking want to be here. About Shepard, not Shepard's vehicle. See, that's the plan. If I bitch and complain a lot, DK will find it annoying and he'll follow rules. Ultimate strategy. Oh god, I'm gonna burn for it! Never mind, I didn't say anything. <laughs> Shutting up now. These bullets don't feel like they're hitting me. Is it really hot in here? Is there, like, vehicle parkouring in Mass Effect? What the fuck?
Well, I'll get to manually controlling it. Don't fucking worry. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, uh, okay. That piece flew. I shouldn't have continued to try to walk on it. Just fucking said later. God, they're noises. There you go. Goodbye. my armor. I'm feeling kind of exposed out here. I need to wear my protection. I'll have their shield. I like having energy drain if I was the person with it. Always nice. Especially if it gives you your shields back. I don't know where I'm going, but my leg's asleep. I have to stretch my legs. I like sharing unnecessary info. Too good. Ah, oh, jump scare. Oh no. They've seen us. Well, no shit. Maybe. Come here. May I have some more? I'll have to you. Right, well, I have this. What does this do? Uh oh. Well, that's gone. Well, that definitely looks like something that could do some damage if I hit the target. Ugh. Oh, it just goes through. Okay, well. If I die, I'm haunting you, Shepard. <laughs> if I die, I'm haunting you, Shepard. Uh, please do. Wink, nudge. It doesn't exactly hit as hard as I'd like it to. wish people would stop hitting me in the face with the rockets. Fuck okay. it. Every door. Oh, Jesus. All right, Talik. They both got shotguns. That's probably why they're not doing so great. I should probably get around to fixing that.
I... Okay. Ah. Oh, stop. Are you receiving this? Commander Shepard, this is Dr. Archer. Please respond. I hear you, Doctor. We've hit the override at Vulcan Station and are moving on. Shepard out. Renegade. There's a whole nother station. It's taking longer than I thought. Commander, that was a daring piece of work. Vulcan Station was a success. You still need to go to Prometheus Station and override the lockdown from there. Good luck. Well, yeah, that fire temple sucked. Please tell me we're not going to be in lava again, and this is going to be like the water the temple. Conditions indicate an aesthetically pleasing view nearby. Organic life forms may wish to take note. Thanks. Better not be in the water. I was gonna. I'm fucking kidding. If it's near a bunch of water. Not here. Another Cerberus data packet has been recovered. Four more remain. Over here? No, just the death of all life in existence? Got it. It's the thing that it looks like we're trying to unlock. 